Many parents are still trying to digest the governor's plan. Our David Schumann's live in Lakeville, where some people want to be cautious about in-person learning. David? Safety is, of course, the first thing on the minds of the parents I spoke to. But there are varying levels of risk tolerance. Like one mother that we met said she supports the hybrid learning model with limited capacity and social distancing. Then she said, though, it's no small thing to say we can trust six-year-olds to maintain distancing throughout a school day. Another father agreed it's a tough decision on what to do. He'd like to see his four kids in school this September, and he would trust the district to make it happen safely. I'm really concerned with having them home all year. That would be really hard, I think, on the family and um, and uh, just hard on the kids. They're seeing each other, you know, all year. Uh, it just gets a little difficult. So districts will be using what the governor laid out today to help them make their decisions. What we do know is that all families will have the option of keeping their kids home for distance learning if they feel that's best for them. All right, David, live in Lakeville. Thanks. We should also note that those uh, rules do not apply to private schools announced today. David, thank you.